what's up guys and it's me again and i am here with the countdown beginning it is all beginning right here you can see your part of history it's all beginning right here ladies and gentlemen with number 100 as you saw in that intro ricardo rodriguez and and until stated otherwise in this video all of this information that i have just received will be from his wikipedia page right there So now to some personal info about this wonderful player that we call Ricardo Rodriguez. Born in Zurich, Switzerland on August 25th, 1992. He is now at the age of 22. So he's now very nice and young, very, very vibrant and fresh. And uh, main position, he plays his left back. He plays for the club VFL Wolfsburg. Also plays for the Swiss national team. Played in the World Cup. He has 27 appearances for the Swiss, but he does not have any gold. While in VFL Wolfsburg, he does have 8 goals and 88 appearances. He's also height of 5'11", so he's very good at heading the ball, in my opinion. So, now on to his transfer history, and this will be from TransferMarket.com. See him right there. So, he has only played for two clubs in his career, which would be in his hometown of Zurich with FC Zurich. And, of course, VFL Wolfsburg, which is his current side he is on. As you as you saw, his value is £20 million pounds now. So that's a big jump from the $7.5 that Wolfsburg bought him for back in 2012. And um, that's pretty much it about his transfer history. And now we're going to get into his style of play that he, uh, that he likes to play and that he's really good at playing. So... First, I'm going to show you a video of a great save, a great clear off the line that he did against some team in the Bundesliga. I did not see the team, but it was a, it was an absolute beauty and the coach livid. Lovely back heel from Safarovic. And back again. This is brilliant football. Oh, it is scraped off the line by Ricardo Rodriguez. So as you saw there, that was brilliant defending by Ricardo Rodriguez. And this is why I call him the complete left back and complete defender if you will because he can run up the field he can cross balls in whip in crosses and set up his players to score but he can also defend on the other end if anyone needs help his goalkeeper or his two center backs two center halves that he really needs he really needs to help out so that's just great from him he's regarded as one of the most attacking fullbacks in the Bundesliga, however so attacking is on his mind he has a high attacking work, work rate with probably a medium defensive work rate. So he's great at whipping and crosses, as I mentioned. Great skill in place. And he's complete he's completed so many take ons in the in the Buddhist Slinger this year that it's not even funny and whipped in crosses to set up goal scoring opportunities for his teammates. And something that you might not expect out of a left back, but it's pretty impressive. He is a free kick expert. A free kick expert. He's good at free kicks. And you might want to watch out if this guy steps up about five yards outside the penalty area to take a free kick. Goalkeepers, beware. I am warning you right now. So now to the FIFA aspect of things. that I, I'm a big FIFA guy and I love FIFA. And I, uh, I want to talk to him about his in-game performance that I've heard. So here first I'm going to give you his card right there. So as you saw there, he is not the fastest, 76 pace could be much faster for left back. But as you saw there, his defending and physical was very good for a left back and I thought that his in-game performance would be really well and that he would be a complete left back in the game as well as in real life. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I hope to get number 99 up soon by Thursday or Friday, maybe even tomorrow. But 100 got it up like I promised as quickly as possible and this was pretty quick in my opinion I got it up the next day so I hope you guys have a great day and peace and see please check out number 99 when it's up love you guys bye